some, some positives to take towards tomorrow? Uh, yeah, I mean, on a Tuesday night, college baseball, look at scores all over the country, this stuff happens, right? We've got to be better to, we can't give up a seven spot, right? Um, their guy pitched exceptionally well. I thought their hitters did a nice job too. Um, we've got to be better. We've, we've got to be better in everything that we do, especially in that inning. We had the first four guys with two strikes. We couldn't put them away. So credit to them, and we got to we got to work on it a little bit better. Uh, but the guys kept battling all night, and, you know, put a little charge in the game for everybody who stuck around late, and um, uh, we'll just be ready for tomorrow. Thoughts on uh, Dylan and Jake's homers in the night? Um, I'm happy for him. You know, it's it's always good. You know, Dylan, it's his fourth at bat in an FAU uniform and he gets a home run so good for him and um, Jake you know I, I hope it kind of he actually had some decent at bats he hit the line drive down the line the guy made a nice catch on he hit the ball in the left center field that I, I thought was hit pretty well and then he you know at the end of the night he got that so maybe this will kind of kick start him a little bit and what are some of the best silver lines that you can take away from this game back here? Silver linings. I thought Beanie pitched really good. Max Martelov was fantastic, and he kind of, you know, been had not had a great January, February. Um, of course, Dylan, and uh, I thought that you know John Schroeder and, and Spencer Rich had some decent at bats, and you know it was good to see. Although he did give up two runs, it was good to see. Um, Steven Andrews out there uh, uh, gets him out. He had, he's struggled a little bit. So, um, you know, there are some, and the other silver lining is it's over. Coach, what is your message to your team tonight to get ready for the game tomorrow? Uh, you know, baseball, like I said, is there's going to be nights like this, both on, you're going to be on both sides of it, right? Um, the, the thing is, you can't think you're bad. You can't think you're too good. We just got to take a look at, you know, look at some things that happened. Um, I told the guys, the thing that you have to do is they have to get back to the locker room, get showered, eat their dinner, go home, get some rest, and be ready to play tomorrow. You know, the greatest thing about tonight is there's tomorrow, right? Um, can't panic. We just got to keep doing our thing. And, you know, those things happen in baseball. Coach, what can you say about the last inning rally there, putting the four on despite being down 11 to two? Oh, I, you know, it's good. Some guys, you know, Slats hadn't played a bunch. He got a hit by pitch, and you know, it was really nice to see Carter Brady have a positive at bat. He's had a couple rough ones, and then of course the Jake hitting the home run, like we mentioned earlier. You know, he's trying to get himself going. Um, so maybe for Carter and and um, for Jake, this provides a little kind of oomph to, you know, buoy their spirits, so to speak, and get them going. Um, but uh, it was good. You know, I, I you never want to see the, these type of games just roll out, you know. It was good to see these guys in the dugout stayed in it. And, you know, it was um, it was good. Thank you. Thanks, Coach.